A company with over 4 million customers launched an NFT project and sold out in less than 24 hours. I want you to pause this video right now and comment below, yes or no. Do you currently own a ledger, hard wallet? Comment right now for me, yes or no. And make sure you subscribe and hit that like button. Welcome to Go to the Metaverse, my friends. We got an exciting jam-packed show for you today. Let's get right into it. Yassi's still on holiday, uh, but I am here to hold you down. Uh, let's get right into it. Eve Price, Eve Price. Oh my goodness, Eve Price is down $1,369. Last week we were hanging around $1,600 and we thought we were on top of the world. Uh, it is down, it is down. And guess what, my friends? NFTs are down as well. Floor prices are low. I don't, I don't remember even seeing them this low. Uh, Board API Club, 86 Ethereum. Crypto punks are down almost 10% since yesterday. Moons are down to 16. Moonbirds are 19. Cool Cats, three and change. Doodles at 10. Uh, v Friends, just above seven. Um, yeah, the market is down right now. But as we saw last week, things could rebound pretty quickly. And this might be a good opportunity. Hashtag not financial advice. Do your own research to potentially find that blue chip NFT uh, that you've been wanting to buy for a really long time. Comment below. Let me know. Are you currently buying? And if yes, what are you currently buying? Uh, and I'll tell you what I'm buying. Full disclosure, I aped in this morning into Ledger. Yes, this is what we're going to talk about on the show. I think it is an interesting project. Uh, I aped in into a market pass ledger. Uh, for those of you who don't know what a ledger is, a ledger is a hard wallet. This is a company that's been around since 2014. And they have over 4 million customers. I'm a proud Ledger customer myself. And this is not, I'm not getting paid by Ledger. This is not promotional. Uh, this is to protect your ass. So if you do not have a hard wallet, I strongly recommend you purchase one, whether it's a Ledger or one of their competitors. But this is probably the most important thing you need to have in order for you to keep your NFT safe. And what it is, it's basically, a little hard drive um, that, that you can put your code on. And every time you do a transaction, uh, whether you're purchasing or selling an NFT or signing into your wallet, you must physically sign in on the ledger. So what it does is it gives you do often off it gives you a dual step where you actually are able to protect yourself. Uh, so it's just like uh, two fa. 2FA authentication on Twitter or Discord, except it is a physical piece. So unless somebody actually has it, they're not able to hack into your account or at least nothing that we have heard of yet, even though the hackers and the scammers are getting a lot more sophisticated. And I wouldn't be surprised if they figure out a way to hack ledgers. Uh, let's hope they don't. But uh, so here's what Ledger did. They got into the NFT game, which I think is a very smart move. Uh, why? They already have a customer base. Uh, they have 4 million customers that use their product and know their name and have spent money with them. Um, this is a product that's been recommended by Forbes, TechCrunch, Bloomberg. Um, so what they did is they, they launched Ledger Market Pass. They created 10,000 of these. They minted a 0.3. Um, and they sold out in less than 24 hours. Uh, current floor price is about 0.55. So if you minted a 0.3, you are up right now, my friend. Uh, they have done 2,100 2, ETH in volume uh, on secondary, which is a hefty number, and it's moving. It's a number one. It's a number one uh, ranked. NFT uh, through OpenSea right now. There's actually a lot of hype, a lot of buzz around it. And I think for a few different reasons. One of them being now, well, one of them is you get a one of you get a limited edition black on black nano X. 
So that value alone, I believe a Nano X is about two, three hundred dollars. So just by buying the NFT, you're getting a physical product, and it is a limited edition where there's only be ten thousand of these ever made. So for some reason, this NFT blows up. You're getting a physical in the box, and if you're a collector, that could be worth money for you down the line. Uh, you have to hold on to your NFT until November 3rd. November 3rd is when you can officially start to claim your, your physical nanos, which could be your new hard wallet, or it could go into a box somewhere unopened and held as a collectible. So that's one reason uh, people, people are excited about it. The second reason is they're launching a marketplace and there's gonna be collaborations with some of the best known brands from music, fashion, uh, digital art, sports, Web3, and culture at large. Uh, RTFKT, Tat Cure, Brick, Dead Fellas, and Jen Stark are some of the collabs they already announced that you're going to be able to have early access and allow list access just by holding the market past Genesis Edition. So I think that is a big deal. Right off the top, they're telling you, hey, we're launching. There's going to be other projects that are going to be launching through our platform. And uh, just by having our NFT, you're going to be added to the allow list. Now, here's what the, the, a lot of the conversation of why people are excited about this. Pre-Mint, which is another collector pass, uh, sitting at 0.8 Ethereum right now, at one point was almost up to 3 ETH. Uh, this is another tool where people are using to find, about, 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 find out about other NFTs and get early allow list access. So people are saying, hey, look, Ledger has more connections, more brand name than Premint does. So we're going to bet that if Premint was able to get to three Ethereum, um, the Ledger priced at 0.55 is a buy. And hashtag not financial advice, do your own research. I agree with that comment. I think this is a brand that has a customer base, that has a brand name. And they have opportunities to create a big marketplace for themselves if they execute correctly. Now, that is a big if, but right off the bat, they're telling you, hey, here's the partnerships we secured. Here's the collaborations we're doing. Here are some names. You know them. RTFKT, Clonex, uh, Tag Cure, one of the biggest watch brands in the world. Dead Fellas. Everybody loves Dead Fellas. So to me, I think it is enough. Uh, at this price point, what if if being this price this cheap, it is a buy, um, and it is a buy, and I'm interested to see what they end up doing with it, what ends up coming out of it, uh, and look, you know, the way they sold out this project, they went to some of these large projects and gave them a loud list. Admit one got one, uh, Death Files got one. I'm sure some other big big NFT projects got one. So they have those relationships, and I'm interested to see how they utilize them. So for me, I give it I give it 4.5 goats out of five. 4.5 goats. So that is a buy for me. Uh, interesting to see what happens. Once again, hashtag do your own research. This is not financial advice. Um, so let's see what happens. And another news: if you haven't so already, make sure you subscribe to our show. Hit that bot button below. Uh, and if you subscribe, you automatically get entered into the Goat Vault. The Goat Vault is our way of giving back to you, the community. All you need to do is subscribe. Once we have 5,000 subscribers, we open up that Goat Vault and stop, start giving away those NFTs. Current value is $17,806. But now, if you look at the chart right here, just last week, my friends, we were over 20, I believe over $24,000, $23,000. And not too long ago, we were sitting at over $100,000. My, my, how times have changed. But hey, it's free money. And I hope you guys subscribe and take that money. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. As always, our goal is simple. We want to provide as much value to you guys as possible. Uh, comment below any shows you want us to record, anything you want to talk about us. We do read the comments and answer them. So comment below, share the show with your friends. And we'll see you guys here. Manana. Have a good day, everybody.